This is water over toilet paper and today we are reviewing Enemy Directed by Anand Shankar Starring Vishal, Arya, Mamata Mohandas, Prakash Raj and Mimalni Ravi It's about these two childhood friends who were trained under Prakash Raj but they both go in their own ways and how fate somehow makes them meet and what's their conflict like and why are they such big enemies i think vishal as an actor always tries to find the balance between making like a good action thriller and then also making it indian and it works sometimes and it doesn't work sometimes i think this is one of the better attempts and this is definitely a return to form for anand shankar after the horrible nota his writing is much better here with nice little setups and payoffs for instance there's the setup of arya's character having some kind of allergy to food and they use it in a very nice way towards the end of the film and it also doesn't spoon feed you this information again it just assumes that you remember it and that's always nice i think the action scenes are good there are nothing extraordinary or anything they, but they have enough inventiveness within them to make them work i think the action scenes are also help with the really good score and pretty decent cinematography a lot of props to them because they shot this during pandemic and and uh, that too they have like really big action set pieces and stuff like that the central conflict of the movie is pretty interesting for these two kids who were uh, trained under prakash raj to become police officers and how they both use their training and things like that i think it is interesting but it does get diluted which we will get into when we come talk about the negatives in the film they try to make the antagonist gray and humanize him in a way and most of the movies like war and whenever they get these like big two actors and it's supposed to be like him versus him by then you know that they both are the good people and somehow uh, because of chance one uh, turned out a little gray and then they both team up to fight someone else but i like that they don't do that here uh, they still make him grave and all that but they make his flaw more personal than some weird circumstance type thing and the movie has pretty decent performances i feel like uh, for the most part this movie is pretty decent it's it's not insanely interesting or anything neither is it boring it's sort of in the middle The biggest problem with this movie is that it tries to be too many things and this is one of the challenges or trappings of of any genre piece in commercial indian films where the filmmakers think they need to have like a romance they need to have the songs they need to have the sentiment they need to have the social message and all these things sort of dilute the essence of a fun action thriller and uh, most of the first half is like wasted on these uh, trappings in a way there's some big action scene happening and you're like holy shit what's going to happen and suddenly they cut to <laughs> in this movie the social message thing is that oh uh, immigrants who are living in singapore and ah uh, it's so sad but this feels so force then because the central conflict of the movie doesn't really revolve around this the next problem with the film is the overly stretched climax where uh, it sort of devolves into dark night territory where there's like a uh, oh i give you choice and you must do an immoral thing to save yourself type situation and that was odd and that too that sequence is stretched for so long and like there are some plot holes or loopholes in the action scenes and stuff like that mostly to do with the sec- uh, like the third act i think enemy is a pretty decent action thriller that gets bogged down by the commercial movie trappings but there are still a lot of enjoyable things within the movie and i give this movie a 6 out of 10 thanks for watching this review you can check out our other reviews that we did in this diwali season like this video and subscribe to this channel and share this video do all the good things 
and if you hear crackers in this entire recording it's because it was diwali during the time i was recording this so enjoy it happy diwali folks i guess